What's up guys, Marquis from VIP Shop Management. Uh, I want to talk about Reminder. Uh, we finally activated Reminders right here. Just uh, just click on right all, all the way at the bottom. You have Schedule an Appointment or Reminder. Uh, click on Reminder. It's just like the appointment, but it's it's not an appointment basically. So let's say we want to put Reminder for next month, September, and let's say Timing Belt. And you can set the time, but you don't have to. Just click Confirm. And you're gonna see a bell at the bottom, so it's pretty cool. If we go to reminder right here, how do you view reminders? Just go to um, under your calendar, so which is pretty cool. It's right there. That's the reminder. You can open it and see where it is. Create an estimate, all that from here. And uh, another thing I want to talk about is that if we go back here, so when you create an estimate too for the customer, you're gonna see a bell right there. Just click on it so you can see what's what's that about. Um, uh, another thing, uh, if I want to add an appointment, I still can add an appointment right there. So I schedule an appointment and let's say we're doing uh, an alignment on the 18th. And uh, let's say we're doing it. We added, see, now you can say 7.45. Let's say we're doing it at 2.15 p.m. on the 18th. Confirm. And now you can see two of them. So if I click on that, I'm going to see like there's two bonds right here so I can scroll. So you can have unlimited basically reminders and appointments it's not going to be more than five but yes you can have so you can switch between them you can delete the appointment or the reminder from here too now so let's say uh, i just want to delete the the timing belt just confirm and it's gone it goes back so i can see appointment delete confirm and it's done so all right i'm glad i did this because uh, people have been asking me about this mark when you gonna let that reminder work now it works anyway appreciate you guys until next time thanks for watching